Yeah. You gotta go. Yeah. Common Cause for President, you gotta go. Protests erupted in early 2018 when it was revealed that the Milwaukee Health Department had failed to follow up with the families of up to 8,000 children who had tested positive for high levels of lead. When did you learn there was a criminal investigation underway? Months later, word came that the Milwaukee County District Attorney was investigating the health department. What I've told the people in my administration is to fully cooperate with investigations. Now, after a nearly four-year-long investigation, the DA's office said it had found insufficient evidence to prove a crime was committed and no charges would be filed. There's no state lead levels. For, for any children. Former Health Commissioner Bevin Baker stepped down from his post when the scandal broke. During a rare interview with 12 News in 2019, he denied mismanaging the lead abatement program and blamed problems on other city departments and the former mayor. I'm compelled to say that the mayor's office was wrong. But the DA's findings say the health department did mismanage its lead poisoning prevention program, showing repeated instances where the agency knew of a child's elevated blood lead level and yet did not investigate the child's residence for lead exposure. But investigators suggest that they were hampered in this case by the health department's record keeping, which the DA's office called unreliable. What happened in the past was unacceptable, but we're not going to settle for that anymore. Just minutes after it was announced, 12 News asked acting Mayor Cavalier Johnson about the DA's decision not to file charges. Is this justice for those children and their families? Listen, um, we've got a responsibility to make sure that those kids and kids in the future, right, who may have you know similar incidents, uh, don't encounter what they did before. Well, Kent, have those problems within the health department been fixed? Yeah, the uh, DA's report actually notes substantial improvement under the current health department leadership. That department has followed up on all of the cases in question in the uh, original report and issued a statement today saying that they're working to ensure that this sort of oversight never happens again. But they also continue to point out that uh, lead is a serious and uh, continues to be a public health crisis here in Milwaukee. Ken Wayne Scott in downtown Milwaukee tonight. Ken, thank you.